Welcome back to Forte Sports. Make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. Leave a like for the algorithm that does help the channel grow. So we got former first round pick Andrew Bogut, who was also from Australia. He had his take on the Josh Giddy situation on his podcast. And before I was about to um, start editing this video, there is a report from TMZ that Newport Beach is looking into this Josh Giddy situation. So things is about to get a little interesting, but I do want to let you guys hear what Andrew Bogut had to say about this situation. And then I'm going to come back and give you my thoughts. Always workarounds to everything. So that's my only issue with this whole thing. Like, you know, obviously we don't have the facts to it, but what about that scenario, Bogues? Like, yeah, no, 100%. I, 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 I read about that. I, I read the exact thing. Like people said, well, what's to stop yeah. someone doing what you just said? And I, I think it's just a messy situation. I think Josh yeah. hopefully learns a hard life lesson from this, regardless of, of, of where it goes. Obviously, if it's the, you know, what I said, if, if he knowingly did it, and which I yeah, for I, sure. which I've been told is completely not the case. Um, yeah, but even if 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 Josh said, okay, I take you for face value, you're 19, but he's still thinking, is she really? That's enough for me to say I'm I'm not doing this. Like you know, and that's where he's got to learn his lessons. Um, you know, talking yeah. about the 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 comments we made last week about the NBA groupies and all that kind of stuff, it factors into this as well. These are kind of things that now. You got to be really careful. Um, you know, you, do you ask for ID? Do you do this? Do you do that? Who knows? But I remember, you know, when I was, I don't know what it's like in the US in high school, but I remember when I was in high school and, I, and, and we'd have, you know, year nines and tens, girls that were in my class would be getting picked up by, by guys after school that were, had their licenses and in Australia you need to be 18 to have your license, right? So they, they were one year removed from that high school. They might've been year 12 last season. They graduated. And now they're picking up year nines and tens and you know and i was kind of always like no like that's just 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 weird and wrong right but it was it was kind of the thing at least here in australia and you always looked at it like those kids thought they were cool but like i said whenever you you're, you're, you're on that on that line you're yeah. flirting with danger and that's why i think josh has messed up like if if you're you're, you're messing around that that nine, 18 19 17 maybe you don't know just no like for me yeah. that's me he's got so much to lose as we've seen you know now like regard this is the thing regardless of what comes out in the next week or two and even if it gets to a point where it's like she did lie he didn't know he thought she was 19 that doesn't matter now all these memes and all this shit now <laughs> like he's he's that's going to be there forever right it's hard to take back on social media like i said if it is the alternative where he knew, knowingly knew you know 15 then I'm, I'm right there with those people and saying like yeah that's a, that's terrible behavior but it's hard to take back like you said no real credible um outlets have reported on this for that very reason it's just gone oh you know there's some allegations now that's kind of the most it's been in the media but yeah i, I just don't know where it goes to to, to solve this puzzle because from what i understand the family of the girl and the girl herself have you know knowingly said they're not they're not moving forward with any charges, and I think they're the ones that hold the key to it. If they if they come out and tomorrow decide, yeah, you know, we think he did he did know she was fifteen. <laughs> He's in some trouble, right? I'm, but it's just a messy situation. Sure. Yeah, Bogues, I'm not sure. And again, I, I'm no legal expert, obviously, but if the state wants to go forward with it. I don't think I so. I wonder if they could still go forward with it if they want to, even if they don't want to press charge. I don't think so. That's a yeah. question I had too. I know, I know, because okay. in California it's eighteen. You know, Cloma it's sixteen. But this happened in California. Yeah. That was my question. Was like, can the state independently outside? Andrew Bogut also said that OKC Thunder knew about it for about a year on, on his podcast, and that the young lady's family could have pressed charges, but they didn't because they. I mean, she she was lying about her age, so they're saying, and it kind of reminded me of Chris Anderson's situation, Birdman, a couple of years back when he was messing around on the age girl, but he did not know about it because you know she didn't look her age. She looked like 15, 14, she's like what, like 14, 15 years old, and she did not look her age. But there was also a third party involved. I think he met the young lady on a date nap and that third party was hacked hacked in hacked, hacked them some way and intercepting their messages and relaying them back and forth between the two it was crazy and you know
know, he was doing he was doing what the players do today. They fly the girl out, do what they, you know, do do what they gonna do with the girl, get them on up out of there. The players do that today, but it was it was crazy. But he was able to clear his name and get back to the NBA with the Miami Heat thing. That's when he won the title with them. But with Josh Giddy, you know, it, it's not looking too good right now. Like things about to get a little, little toasty for Josh Giddy. And if he comes out clean, like Bogut said, let this be a lesson to him. And hopefully some other young guys around his age learn from this as well. But post comments, let me know what you guys' thoughts on this. Do you think he's innocent? Make sure you like and subscribe to the channel.